don't feel nothing. You don't feel anything here. You feel me touching through there? No. Something lighter. Yeah, lighter, but I don't feel it now. <clears throat> oh my god, that's crazy. You doing okay? Not bad. She's the one having all the problems over there. <laughs> well, I'm sorry. I was like, you know, there's nobody to see somebody's toes. She was saying that before you pulled the hole in, though. Hmm. Hmm. I see the end of the rainbow. That's right. I see in a month I can kick Beckett. <laughs> there you go. I done told him he's got it coming. <laughs> Who are you going to get? Oh, it's got our glove. Oh. He's been working on a good kicking. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Thank you. You can cry for me about seven or eight when the numbness starts wearing off. When the numbness goes down. I didn't know it was going to be so rough. Yeah, it's, it gets sore. Now I know why they use it as torture. Yeah. Well, so what we're going to do now is use a chemical down in the corners, and this prevents the nail bed from growing back, so it kills the matrix cells, which uh, grow new nail. And so then it won't pinch into the corners, and... Um, Remember when it got infected and the sides blowed up? It's... Uh, 98% successful that it doesn't grow back. So what you're going to notice afterwards, though, you're going to notice some redness around. That's the chemical reaction of the medicine, sodium hydroxide that I'm using. And it's going to look, you know, maybe even infected to you. Uh, it should have some drainage. That's normal. It should not have any pussy drainage or it should not have a bad odor to it. If it does, then we need to call an antibiotic for you, but um, it probably will not. It'll just be red and some clear drainage. You need to keep the uh, sites cleaned out real well and that allows it to heal up much quicker. 